Good evening, this is your AI host, Jay. I'm here with the automatically generated, Jernita, evening headlines on December 8, 2023. Northern Lights Photographer of the Year 2023 in Pictures I'm concerned about my personal safety, Hong Kong activist Agnes Chow speaks about life in exile. The Guardian, a place of fear, Hong Kong activist recalls years of repression. France 24 English, Agnes Chow, fugitive activist says Hong Kong is now a place of fear. BBC, democracy activist Agnes Chow says she still feels under the Hong Kong police's watch in Canada. The Independent, democracy activist Agnes Chow says she still feels under the watch of Hong Kong police in Canada. Israel says Reuters journalist Abdullah was in a combat zone when he was killed. Reuters, Issam Abdullah, rights groups want Israel investigated over killed journalist. BBC, Israel, journalist killed in Lebanon was in, active combat zone. Al Jazeera English, Reuters journalist Issam Abdullah, killed by Israeli tank shell. The Guardian, important to be fully probed, US Blinken on reporters killed in Israel war. At least 475 carbon capture lobbyists attending COP28. The Guardian, the president of COP28 is an oil executive, climate talks in Saudi Arabia fuel cynicism. MSNBC, fossil fuel lobby digs in its heels at COP28. Daily Maverick, COP28 meaning, what is the UN climate summit? Elizabeth McGill, UPenn loses $100 million donation after House anti-Semitism testimony. Revealed, more than 1,000 unmarked graves discovered along EU migration routes. Gaza society, on brink of full-blown collapse, says UN official. Hunter Biden faces second federal indictment, this time on tax evasion. BBC, Hunter's latest indictment is bad news for Joe Biden. The Spectator, Hunter Biden's tax indictment, drugs, escorts and girlfriends. UNLV shooting suspect Anthony Polito had target list before attack, live. The Independent, UNLV shooting, ex-professor had target list when he killed three on campus. BBC, three people killed in UNLV shooting identified. CBS Evening News, UNLV shooting, suspect Anthony Polito seen in new video after killing professors. Jax Wilson, toddler who was snatched in street in Australia found 180 miles away. Sky News, boy, too, found 180 miles away after being snatched in broad daylight. Metro.co.uk, Jax Wilson missing updates, boy, too, found over 180 miles away after he was kidnapped by couple who, Asa. The son, boy, abducted, in broad daylight is found. News.com.au, Jax Wilson, urgent search for toddler who was snatched in street in Australia. I can still smell the bodies. What happened after Hamas left the Nova Festival site in Israel? Sky News, bringing broken survivors of the Israel Nova Festival attack back from darkness. BBC, Israel-Palestine conflict, Israel Nova Festival attack back from darkness, Israel vs Hamas, N18B. CNN News 18, Israelis remember victims of Hamas terror attack two months on, DW the 12th of July 2023. DW, English, Israel Nova Festival attack, thousands of survivors facing mental health challenges, BBC News. Putin to stand for fifth term as Russian president. BBC, I will run again for president in 2024, says Putin. The Times and the Sunday Times, Vladimir Putin to run for Russian president again in March 2024. The Guardian, Russia's Putin announces presidential candidacy in 2024 elections. France 24 English, Russia's Vladimir Putin to run for president for fifth time in 2024 election, ITV News. Thousands of dead fish mysteriously wash up on beach in Japan. Israel Gaza latest, we arrest everyone, Israeli military says after video emerges. Israel Gaza war live, UN Security Council vote on ceasefire resolution delayed. The Guardian, Israel Gaza latest news, UN Security Council to vote on Gaza ceasefire resolution. BBC, UN chief addresses Security Council, Al Jazeera English, US to oppose Arab-backed resolution calling for urgent Gaza ceasefire. The Guardian, 
Hamas brutality can never justify collective punishment of Palestinians, says UN chief. This was all for the news. Thanks for listening. Please do not forget to like and subscribe.